Hey guys, what's one here? And today, boom, we're gonna play with Spast. Well, actually, we're not gonna only play with this weapon because I wanna share a few. Boom, and boom. <laughs> I wanna share a few information with you guys about this weapon because I consider this weapon uh, as the best shotgun in this game. So forget about K KSG, forget about Sega FA even forget about Sega 12k and make sure to really really uh, listen carefully in case you cannot follow me uh, while I'm giving you all these informations about uh, Splash 12 oh my god this is just insane I, I need to focus anyway I'm gonna leave I'm gonna just leave all these informations uh, somewhere on the screen so you guys can uh, read and actually decide and check all the stats about this weapon because Trust me when I tell you this is the best shotgun ever and what's even better, it doesn't require a GP to unbreak this weapon, it doesn't require to finish weapon task for this weapon. Uh, weapon task is 25 storm kills and many of you guys really really don't understand and you get confused like what do I need to finish a weapon task. Once you finish it. Yeah, uh, it's called uh, Spast 12 Punk Buster and oh my god this weapon is insane <laughs> I cannot even focus on giving you all these information oh my god come on one more I think for storm kill then we're gonna finally return to cheater or not the hacker okay okay let, let, let me not focus let me just continue talking because as more as I listen and watch around I start to get shaky and I cannot focus on actually gameplay so uh, after 25 storm kills you will get a holographic sight and it's gonna be renamed to punk buster plus it's not gonna have a box shot but actually you just gonna fire one single bullet from your spas and really you are not allowed to hip fire like that but you really have to aim down the side plus that bullet is way stronger uh, of course if you're playing normal mode and fighting those renters then this is the weapon that you wanna use of course with the weapon task but definitely I'm just recommending you not to use a weapon task for this weapon uh, it cost uh, first it belongs to weapon set come on 17 1 and I've been thinking I'm about to do a storm kill what the hell almost a pro kill uh, so what I was about to say yeah it belongs to weapon set uh, 6 it cost 125 kcr to unbreak it and I think uh, to buy it for CR and I think 350 GP to unbreak it but what is even better you don't have to unbreak this weapon actually you can play as much as you want and I think this is the one of the rarest weapon in Contra Force that doesn't require you to unbreak it or to repair that but in case you want to repair it uh, as I said let, let's stop talking about all these things I'm, I'm just gonna put you somewhere here left or right all these informations about uh, Spast 12 so you can just check it and read it because stats are just amazing so uh, as as long as you play and your weapon is losing accuracy it's even better because you need uh, that thing to you you need those bullets to spray around and spray so like that you really have a big chance to hit your enemies in the head and that is just what you want to use so uh, let's say usually weapons that belongs to CR weapons are something like uh, you have to play two or three rounds maximum then you have to go to uh, repair your weapons then go back you need to wait for slots and so on so on so you're just wasting time actually with spats you can play as much as you want uh, unless you see the red weapon on your screen and of course you need to repair it also I think uh, you need 125 credits double headshot credits per one repair point so it's just very cheap for 
a weapon that belongs to weapon set 6 so if you are a fan of shoguns if you are a guy who cannot purchase GP but you wanna play with one weapon that will last for a longer time period and of course you're playing a deathmatch map so really really small maps like evac you're not the guy who's able to rent penetration and definitely this weapon is for you and trust me when I tell you it's just a great even for fighting uh, renters but have on mind close combat is a key you know try to snipe those guys across the map because you just gonna fail so if you plan to play normal mode here on bay 5 this weapon will be great if you plan to play evac on normal mode this weapon is gonna be great so just focus on those smaller maps and don't be a guy who's gonna bring this weapon on all the thumbnail or maybe even on site so it's just a one big mistake but for those small maps it's just awesome trust me guys and actually uh, as longer as I play you see I'm not even focused on the game so I'm dying a little bit more because I'm trying to provide you all these important information but hey actually you can see really that this weapon is doing good so don't be a guy who's just using a Sega 12k thinking hey it's just a great okay thanks a lot bro someone is watching my videos thanks a lot so you you can just compare this weapon to Sega 12k and imagine if we get a customization no I'm not the best uh, if we get the customization for past while and you're able to add a silencer on this weapon I think definitely this is gonna be a one of the greatest weapons so you just need to focus you just need to a little bit practice with the hip fire to get used where is the center of your screen and it's just gonna be great actually you know what I haven't tried but I think it's not working to penetrate through those wooden boxes and see actually if you are able to shoot and kill your enemies actually here on hardcore I did notice that through those boxes you are able to kill people with desert eagle so I guess you are oh look at this guy you are able to kill even with other weapons okay so yep and there is one more there is a one more oh oh dude your terminator you did survive a mortal strike and it was oh look at this guy he came back for more songi or something like that so no problem bro i forgot to reload that sometimes i just forgot to reload game yeah what is also good with shotguns you can oh so kill nice you can do uh reloading anytime you want on hardcore you're not gonna lose your bullets and i've seen that many of you guys are dropping half use magazine and you're dropping away your bullets actually here on hardcore with spas and with another shotguns of course not only sega 12k and sega fa you can reload and put one or two shells in your shotgun cancel it with just a left click and continue to walk and fight so uh, actually i'm never trying to keep my shotgun empty and of course i'm never trying to uh, reload my shotgun after each kill but i guess it's gonna be uh, the best if you're pretty sure really that no one is around the corner and you have time to do that like that okay this guy like that you're gonna have always eight bullets in your weapon and you are ready to last longer on the battle and i think it's just a great so i gave you so many informations about this weapon and i hope i try uh to present you as close as possible this weapon uh, not even with the kills but also with the uh, uh, gameplay so it's up to you guys to rate this weapon to tell me down in comments what you think really about fast well do you have it uh, tasked 
and are you using a weapon test on this weapon or you are simply using this weapon without the weapon test so i'm gonna be super happy if you leave a like button comment on my video subscribe if you haven't already and i really hope i'm gonna catch you in one of my next videos till that take care stay safe and bye bye guys ah prosto cheaterski